Mm -hmm. I'm Mark Diedrich with Quo Diedrich Chi, and I'm here uh, with John Schoenbeck of Lake Toxaway Country Club, and we're talking about our Forever Young uh, blog series. One of the core design principles at, that we have at, uh, at KDC is the development of a multi-generational club. That's a philosophy that, that we've had, and it's been following a trend that we see nationally. Um, can you talk a little bit about how uh, Lake Toxaway sort of honors the past while it prepares for the future generations here at the club? You need to focus on uh, not just the young families and the folks coming in. That's critical, critical part of the business. But you certainly have got to respect and make sure you're taking care of those members that got you where you are. I think um, you handle that with different, uh, a lot of different programming for one, um, but also having more, you know, keeping up with the traditional events too that make the make the club the happiest place on earth for our members. You know, I mean, it's uh, I had a I'd worked for a previous mentor of mine who used to call it Disneyland for adults. Mm -hmm. And that, um, you know, it really is tough, it's tough to get away from that, it, no matter what else I think about, really. I mean, members need to come here and feel that, uh, you know, they've left their worries somewhere else. And this is the place when they walk in the door, whether it's the, the welcome they get or any kind of, um, you know, magic things that happen while they're here and to the time they leave. You know, they've got to feel that this is, uh, this is their place. And it's, it's, can you tell us about golf here at Lake Toxaway? Sure. Yes. I mean, I don't want to downplay golf too much. I mean, it's certainly still a big, big part of the business and began with the clubhouse or with the golf course renovation, I should say, and uh, basically reversed the golf course, uh, made it much more playable, much more enjoyable. And it's good. It's a good, uh, it's a good track. It's not, uh, you know, overly difficult, which I think is important these days. You know, you've got to have a good time when you get out there and play. You can't, uh, get out there and just have it wear you out. Uh, you know, it's a pleasurable course. It's a lot of fun to play. And uh, we're looking at several things in the future, even uh, potentially a legend, uh, female legends golf event for next year, which is exciting and have possibly the Nancy Lopez and, and some of the others up here next year, which will be fun. Fantastic. Can you uh, touch on what non-golf amenities that you have today at the club and specifically uh, the amenities that you'll be adding here with your next phase. Sure. Right. I mean, you've got you've got to be able to have offerings um, that affect and attract a lot of a lot of people, a lot of different members of the family, a lot of their guests, and things like that. So we're we're continuing to expand that. Currently, we've got obviously the golf and the tennis. Croquet has got a great impact here too, with two full size courts. Um, so we've got that. We've um, certainly got uh, a first class fitness facility with great staff up there. Uh, in addition to that, we're doing some other things with our uh, hikes every Saturday. So taking advantage of the natural beauty of, of this area, cycling, there's several different trails, um, whether it's uh, trail, tra trail biking or road biking. Um, and doing some things on the lake, obviously, too. I mean, that's one thing about Lake Toxaway, too. Having the, the largest private lake in North Carolina is, is very special. So we take advantage of that, too. So phase two, a few really strong uh, additions uh, to the program. So we've got a new swimming complex going in. Um, we've got a grill component with that, with a bar. Um, and we're also adding pickle, pickleball courts. I'm very excited about the location of the pool, and it's, uh, it's going to be spe spectacular. Uh, the members are uh, excited about it, support it uh, wholeheartedly. So those, that new addition is going to be uh, a really family-orientated um, fun place that you want to hang out, come on from the lake, come up and get a pizza, take it back on the lake. Um, you know, a lot of events, a lot more programming that we can add with, with facilities like that. We're just, uh, you know, it's been, uh, it's been great here at the club over the last uh, three and a half years or so that I've been here at least. And prior to that, um, it's just a special place and we're just looking forward to the next things that we can do to keep it, keep it special for our members. Um, prospective members and, uh, you know, their families for a long time.